we have to and we will continue to have to uh, develop technologies and mechanisms in partnership. In our labs, we are experimenting with all kinds of technology. DLT, AI, cloud, machine learning. It's about a conversation between developers and product experts on our end and users on the clients. Our true North Star is to build a world where anybody should be allowed to pay anybody instantaneously. This new data revolution which we are facing now is absolutely uh, helping payments to play a central role. As global payments and securities markets continue to grow, rapid shifts in technology are creating massive change and big dollar investments, particularly in transaction banking and cross-border payments. I think that expectation shift means that there's this move towards everything being faster, simpler, and friction-free. The banking customers, the payment service customers, they've got Amazon, right? They, they know what one-click purchase is about. They expect that kind of service um, in your environment. What we're, I think, actually going to start seeing, though, is an evolution of services that sit above the payment rails of how people make the payment. Good news is everyone says open banking is amazing, it's going to transform the world. Bad news is no one can tell you how. We hear that certainly now we're going beyond banking into curating value-added experiences for clients. We have to change from a product-led organization to a client-centric one. We finally need to put the client in the center of everything what we do. At least will be changed in a fundamental way over the next 10 or 20 years because of AI. Machines should do the ordinary to enable people to do the extraordinary.